Hello, I'm here to tell you about X-Trainer, WaveSim, and Antenna Training System that were developed by Soluins. The upper plate is a measuring part which is composed of a digital multimeter, digital storage oscilloscope, and frequency counter. DC variable power supply receives AC power of 110 and 220 volts and 50 and 60 hertz and supplies constant voltage that can be adjusted over a range of 0 to 12 volts. DC fixed power supply supplies fixed voltage of positive 5, positive 12 and negative 12 volts. Signaling device makes signals of sine wave 0 to 10 megahertz and square wave 0 to 5 megahertz. Breadboard allows to configure a circuit of resistors, condensers, inductor, diodes, transistors, and the like. LED display is connected to an element configured on the breadboard and shows whether the input level of the element is low or high. If the input level is below 0.97 volts, red light flickers, and if the level is above 2.0 volts, green light flickers. You can check the input level of an element through the LED's lighting. There are 10 push switches, and they function as an on-off switch to change, open, close, or connection status of a circuit. When the power is on, LED lights. FND display can display up to hexadecimal characters. As it is three channel, the input voltage level is based on 0.97 volt. Toggle switch is used for connection and break of a circuit and consists of three elements. If pressing clock pulse generator button, it generates one pulse clock from 4.8 volt high to 0 volt low and from 0 volt low to 4.8 volt high. When turning the handle of the precision potentiometer right and left, you can change the resistance from 0 ohms to 100 kilo ohms. Application experiment module mount is a part to physically fix add-on modules. Soluins also provides other representative experiment modules. If a new module is required, we will add the module to the product. With this digital multimeter, you can measure selectively variable voltage, fixed voltage, capacitance, diode, buzzer, resistance, current, and duty cycle. The measurable voltage is up to 600 volts. Current is up to 10 amp and resistant is up to 40 mega ohms. Digital storage oscilloscope allows you to check the results of a connected circuit through the input and output terminals at the bottom. Press channel 1 and channel 2 buttons on the DSO screen to select the waveform strength of the circuit voltage connected to channel 1 and channel 2, and press up and down buttons to control the strength. Here, hold button is to hold and show the output waveform. Channel 1 and 2 volt on the DSO means that the voltage per scale is 2 volts and T5 microseconds shows us the time scale of 5 microseconds per scale. Trig button shows the waveform of a selected channel as the standard trigger waveform. Gen button is to change DSO functions to Gen functions. Press run and hold buttons in frequency counter and you can measure the frequency of AC voltage of the circuit connected with the input terminal. As you know, other modules of specific standards that you want can be connected on the module mount. Again, let me show you the strong points of X-Trainer. WaveSim consists of a main body, antenna master, and antenna box. The main body is configured by a built-in circuit of seven sub-modules and antenna masters of mobile and fixed types are one set. 
The antenna box contains DCS dipole antenna, PCS dipole antenna, monopole antenna, patch antenna, and cables.